Hi boys and girls, today I wanted to talk to you about our cereal box projects, our biographies that we're doing about a famous African American. So I wanted to make sure that we knew exactly what we were supposed to do for this. So here we go. First thing that we did is we logged into um, Clever and we went to Miss Cruz's page. And when we went there, then we saw we had all these biography resources. These were the only places that you could do your research except for a book from the library. So once you chose your person, we had our rubric here, which told us everything that we needed to do. First, you picked your person, you had it approved by me. We did our research on those places that you were approved then this is now that you have got all your research done, this is the other parts that you're gonna do. So you have your creative title, you've got our top and bottom panels, our nutritional facts where we're doing our timeline, we have our ingredients where you tell me how you relate to the person, what that person means to you, and then we have some extra spots for just fun, um, creatively, creative um, opportunities. So I wanted to show you a somewhat finished box. This is more of a rough draft. You're more than welcome to add lots of color to it. So this is the front of my box for my Oprah Oats. I have the title on there and then I also added some character traits. I put my name and then I also put a picture of her. So that is the front of my box. The top of my box is telling me her name, her full name, and what she is mostly famous for. The bottom of my box is where I'm going to put my three or more resources. Um, if I used a website, I'm gonna write the name of the website. If I read a book about them, I'm gonna write the name of the book and the author. Now, my nutritional facts on the side this is where we're going to put a timeline of at least eight important dates. These are things that were very important to them. Uh, we, of course, we want to put when they were born and if they died, when they died. My other side is what that person means to them. How do you relate to that person? What do you think about them? Like, did they inspire you? Is there anything about them that you liked or that you would want to change? Then on the back, in class, you're going to write a short biography using all the research that you uh, had collected. And you're gonna write a short biography. It needs to be typed in Word and then shared with me. And then um, that should take up about two thirds of your box. And then at the bottom, you have a creative space for you can do whatever you want down there. That's your advertising. You can make a quiz, you can do drawing drawings. You can make a chart, you can do diagrams, metaphors, fun facts, um, a map, any anything that you think would be like super fun to do. So that is what it looks like. And I thought that might help you figure out what's going on with that. And then uh, we will be presenting these on Monday. There you go. Hope that helps.